If you have a one liter EcoBoost engine from Ford, which has got this wet belt, please watch this video. Hello guys, today we have a 2016 Ford Focus. The problem with this one is that the vacuum pump failed and caused the timing to fail as well. If you wonder how that happened, is because of obviously this bad design of the wet belt this in time if you don't use proper oil and probably even if you do and you don't change it this will break obviously the breeze from this belt will uh, collect into the oil pickup pump also there is a filter on the vacuum pump as well i guess now what happened here is the vacuum pump is lubricated through that little hole there yeah and obviously if the oil doesn't get there the vacuum pump will overheat which makes it to shatter in pieces and uh, stop spinning well you wonder how that can make the engine to fail well, if that stops spinning, obviously that's spin by this uh, camshaft, you see skid there, that is a key that goes into the axle, and obviously with that, if that stops spinning, this camshaft will stop spinning, and then uh, will cause the timing belt to slip, obviously. Now on this engine, I managed to put it back on time but obviously on cylinder number two we have zero compression number one and three we have four bar or two bar or something that very less comparing to what is supposed to be so now I have a different engine here which I'm gonna show you how this uh, vacuum pump works as you can see this is connected here to this to the axle i'm not sure if it's visible inside there but probably once i open the engine i will see it much better obviously you can imagine on the other one uh, so this one is connected to the camshaft and uh, obviously this stopped spinning and uh, yeah cause the damage on the engine. Now I'm trying to make, this one is got low compression, but obviously still runs, but I think one of the cylinder it's got bad compression, which I guess is because of the uh, belt. It's collecting around the rings and uh, the piston rings. And uh, because of that, the piston cannot make compression properly, or maybe something else. I have not checked this engine yet, but what I wanted to do, I want to take this head from this engine and use it on that engine because obviously this one has got good compression. I will obviously check the pistons, make sure they are not damaged or cracked or anything. But because it's still got compression, I guess it was not a hard hit. Maybe on cylinder number two, who knows. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to take the engine apart, take the head and use it on this one now. Uh, what I have here, I have a torque conversion tool, which this will make the bolt open easier. But the problem is with this engine, it does not have a flywheel where I can lock it in place. You see this tool, it's supposed to lock onto the flywheel so I can spin it. Now, in order to attach this, you have to take the drive shaft off and obviously attach it here. And that is the timing tool. And this is the, obviously the, this tool that came to open that bolt. But at the moment I can't open it because of the missing flywheel. But probably once I take that one apart, I can use the flywheel to open this bolt. Or I may be, I may be just uh, use an impact gun because I don't need this block anymore. It's not good. But uh, yeah, I will uh, 
try to take the head on this engine, which I guess is good from what I was told from the previous seller. That was just low compression or number two or something like that. So I guess this is head is good. I will probably just swap it over on that one. Check the pistons. And uh, yeah, will be probably a following video. So yeah, if you have your brake quite hard. And you feel like your pedal is hard to press when you drive. Just stop when you can as soon as possible. Because otherwise... You might need a new engine. As you can see, this one's got very low mileage as well. Probably about 80,000 or something like that. But uh, even less, I will have to check. But uh, you see, the bell probably will still be fine if the vacuum pump won't fail. But because of the vacuum pump, the whole thing was ruined. So yeah, if you think you want to see more of this, please subscribe and like this video so it will encourage me to do more. And yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time.